That's nice. You've got a new Pelly box. Yeah, it's, it's quite nice. It's quite a big one, sturdy. Are we doing nice a review monitor. of a Pelly box? No, it's for watching telly. I've got a, a built in oh, monitor. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, clever, yeah. yeah. What's it really? Okay, in here yeah. is something I've been using for probably two, two, three years even. Oh, right, yeah. Okay. This was made for me. Now, it's got a monitor in the lid, yeah. but the interesting bit is inside. Yeah. And this is a Blackmagic Atem Studio TV switcher. And your sandwiches. And my sandwiches and yeah. whatever else is in there. This now is redundant because they've upgraded it, which is very exciting. So we get what, rid of this. Whole, you get rid of the penny box. Yeah, I'll show you why. Right, let's get rid of the penny box. Get rid of this penny box. Oh! Because they've not made that. That is what I've been using. I know. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to show you what they've made. This This is, was my version of what you... Yes, the next version up, the 4K. For Studio 4K switcher. Nice, but very noisy. Yes. And I've never used it in 4K mode. No, no, that's a good point. So what was the point? Right, we'll get rid okay. of that then. Which brings us... Yep. ...to this. We've gone down wow. in size. <laughs> now you know why I don't need the Peli anymore. Wow. This is the new Atem Studio HD. Yeah, it's this is literally the replacement of the one that was in my Pelican box. Well, it's a lot neater. It's a lot it. neater. Yep. They've listened to a lot of things. This In the range, this is actually the, the cheapest one. Right. However, I think from this upgrade, I think it actually uh, has steals a march on, on your 4K. So it won't do 4K? No, it's HD. That. But then I've never done 4K. And that anymore. really is, is, you know... I'm liking the size. The size, it's already... A, it's really I'm going nice. to get a bit technical. All right, go on. Yeah. Go we on. don't do spec. Yeah. <laughs> it's two thirds of a 19 inch rack. So they've shrunk it, which I think is a really good thing. It's very neat. It's very neat and light. <laughs> you don't need yeah. a great big pelly box for that anymore. No. Um, so I do a lot of kind of multi cam work, as you know, right? right? A lot of directing. Yep. I use a lot of other people's kit, but I use a lot of mine. Now, we managed to, to get hold of this unit, didn't we? And yeah. you and I have actually used this in anger last week. You used it in anger more than I did. Yes. What I don't like is people go, oh, you know, you and I have always said that, you know, we have to actually use something if yeah. we want to talk about what we think of it. So we have done a, a, a real job on this. What I think they've done is added in a lot of feedback. They've listened to right. a lot of things that people want to use. Right. Can I get it so that you're not on any of them? Yeah. Well, don't, don't just press random buttons. Why not? Because you don't know what you're doing, do you? You're not qualified. This could become part of a kit. Because if you go... What, for everybody? For example, I did yeah. it. I worked on a cookery shoot. Yeah. And the client was sat at a table like this, had three monitors, because there were three camera sources. Ah, uh, I know what you're going to say. Right. And so what okay. they, they could do, they could either have the multi-view in front of them, mm -hmm. or just say to them, oh, you can punch up whichever camera you want, just to have a, uh, a look in the main monitor. So with this? Ooh. Ooh. You're just randomly pressing buttons. I am, I am random, because I like doing <laughs> that. All right. Is that why you're not a vision mixer? Maybe. Do you need a laptop? <laughs> no, that's one of the massive changes. What, you don't need one at you all? You don't know. With, uh, with the others, you, c you can connect this to a proper hardware switcher, obviously. Yeah but mostly control it on a laptop, which is what we... Well, that's all I use on mine. Yes, a laptop. But now everything can be done on here. So we've set up three cameras Could here. you actually do a full Vision Mix switched pro live program? I think... Just you, on the front panel. I think you could do a basic two or three camera show. Do that to talkback level. Screw that. I could do that. So you change that there. And if I go to that one, set. At the time, set again. Sorry, yeah. everybody. If if, if you're getting a little TV, bored, just hit the stop menu. button on the thing. I'll go back to there. Oh, you could even if you come there and you press this one, that one. No, don't press. Oh. So it takes me back to there. This is really good. So we've got three cameras set up here. This is actually set to switch preview and cut bus rather than just cut. Yep. So it, but you, we we could change it. So I could, I could have cut the show we did just by doing it this way, just right. like that. Why did you want to go to black? 
Well, you could have just faded to black. I just wanted to get me on all of them. Oh, I, <laughs> look, <laughs> hands off. There's your preview. Now take your preview. Okay. Stand by six. On you six. Uh, right, yeah. Okay. Stand by Paul coming to you on you. Wasn't this uh, is this deja vu from the other day? Yeah. yeah. And what, what was it coming to you? No, on you, Paul. On yeah. you. No, on you. Stand by three. Coming to two. <laughs> Sorry, one. <laughs> We have it without you. So on. I think the speed that we cut our show recently, yeah, you would be able to do on the front panel. Yeah. Uh, whether it's kind of. So can you do wipes and things without? This? Yes. So I've set up quite ready. Are you ready yeah, for this? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, go on. Yeah, go on. Go on. <gasps> well, you're liking uh -huh, now. That's clever. Yeah. That's actually a, a 2D <laughs> DVE move, which is a new thing they've added in. A what? A DVE, digital video effect, darling. Is it? So is that the whole picture sliding off? The whole picture sliding off. Oh. As, but you can choose. So, I'm not going to get into a demo, but let's look at the things I've added that I really like as someone who uses this. You can control all the menus from this screen here. Yep. So, we can choose our sources, preview source, auxiliary source. Now, auxiliary, what I like about this and you like about your other one, is we've been on jobs where they've got a separate monitor, say on a stage yes, or whatever. Yeah, that happens a lot. So we can now put... You want a different feed to that. To the auxiliary. And it can be any of your sources. Yep. It could even be the program output or the preview output. It's great. It's really good. And you set that all on here. So I've set at the moment that's on colour bars. But it can be any of our sources right there. So... You can change colour generator. I'm not going to go into all the stuff, but the things I, I like. So here, so this is the transitions we're right. on at the moment. So we've chosen DVE, which is the funky one. Yeah. But actually, we can go back to a, a mix. So my point is that you wouldn't... Now that's mixing. Ah. But you wouldn't do that live while you're switching. My point is it's too clunky for that. No, but if you could set it up and do a three-camera yeah. edit. That's... Exactly. Straight so, out to a link. So if you started special. on some titles, you play yeah. a BT in and you could just go mix into the first, first shot of your show and then you're away. So can you store graphics and VTs and stuff like that? On it's it? pretty basic for, you can't do any uh, store moving graphics on, on this model. Moving it's graphics, static. as in you can't store video clips no, or anything? No, but right, okay. you can store like name straps or full frame graphics. Right. The difference is, before, they would have to be stored on your laptop. Right. And then you call them in. This has now got some memory. Now it's got its own memory, which means that, I think, was one of the big things they said was, you, if you want to control it just off this, well, it's going to have to have memory then. Right. So you, so you can you can do that. So you can see how easy, I, I quite think the menus are pretty easy to do. You, what's going to be your downstream key, your upstream key, um, things like adjusting fade to black. So there's your media players there, so you can choose what's in. Media Player 1 and 2. So right. my point is that I like it a lot, but say you had to bring some name straps in and you had a few of them, you know, you're trying to no, sit and cut the show. You're not going to go and... You so know. you'd still, for 90% for of what you do, you'd still plug your laptop in? I personally would, yes. Yeah. Now, a clever thing you can do, you can have two laptops connected to this one unit. Right. And I could be cutting the show, if say it's complicated, and you could be firing in the graphics. Name ah, strapped. that's good. So yeah, yeah hand, that's good. Which I think is really clever. It's just such a neat size. And so... It does have a fan in it. It does have a fan, so... But it's quiet. We've, we've got ECM mics, so what can it hear? Pardon? One... No, are there audio meters on the buttons? Yeah. One, two... That's good. It's good, and they're on there as well. And so you can choose... AFV is audio follow, follows video. Uh, yeah, yeah. So you can make the audio chase the video, but obviously you oh, right. normally That's useful. do that. One, two, right here. Yeah. Uh, Why does sound men only count to two? I don't know. Why do sound men only count to two? Because if they get to three, they have to lift something. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go on. I'm just playing here. Mm. So you can now monitor with the headphones on here, which you couldn't before. Monitoring was a bit of a problem before. Yep. And what I, what I did before was, we recorded an output, say onto like a Samurai recorder, yep. Atomos. And you I was then monitoring it off that. But this has a microphone socket as well. And a microphone in. Now, because you can, it's got its own 
talkback. You can use this for talkback. So, and the talkback audio comes down embedded in the SDI cable. What, out to the cameras? Yeah, and back from the cameras. Oh. So if you put your That's headphones clever. on, on the camera. Do you need a special box on your camera then? No, it should come directly off the camera. On the Black Magic yeah. studio cameras. Because they've is, got it built, what, right. They've got okay. it built in. So you can actually have your own talkback system via this. So you could fly away and that's all you need. And a monitor. Yeah. For your multi-view, which is really good. We've got, it's got to be said, the elephant in the room. Yeah. Reliability. Right. You and I have both had black magic switches. Yes. And they've both gone wrong. My, my original Atem, yeah. the uh, HDMI multi-view out yeah. to go into my monitor failed. So I then had to get an adapter to turn it SDI right. to convert the SDI multi-view out to HDMI so I could go to my monitor. You, yours has failed. On a job, wasn't it on a job that we, yeah, you and I were doing? Yeah. Um, I happened to have mine with me, didn't I? Yeah. And if we hadn't had it... Mine, the SDI inputs started failing. They right. just stopped working. But in banks of two. Okay, so that's... that's, yeah. that's I don't a, know what that was. Right. But let's hope... Yes that this is a little more reliable. I'm because hoping if, so. if it's reliable, they've nailed it. Yes. Because that's perfect. Yeah. The, the, the question that, come, that I immediately jumped to is, at what point is a freelance cameraman a production company? When you've got one of these. <laughs> so basically you get this, your whole three camera yeah. production company. Yeah, definitely. It's good and value. that means you, you add production costs onto that. Uh, Profit production cost, so you know your daily rate goes up massively. Do you want to take the Black Magic Design Challenge? I certainly do. Would you swap your Atem Studio HD for this Production Studio 4K? No, you keep your 4K. I'm keeping my Studio HD.